What's up guys, happy Friday. I know everybody right now is having such a hard time staying motivated and training at home. And I tell you guys, I'm one of those people too. Every freaking day, I'm telling you guys, it's a struggle, but we make it work and we love the shit and that's why we do it and that's why we're here. So I just got done wrapping up leg day. Got my boy Bobby Bands behind the lens over here and um, he's filming some of the stuff for you guys. So we got some content. But one of the things that we were just talking about was, you know, everything going on right now with all the at home workouts. What's everybody doing? What are we all doing to kind of help you guys out there? And we we're thinking about it. And I have an exercise that I use a lot with my athletes. That's probably one of my favorite leg day video or not videos, but favorite leg day exercises ever. And it's called pick up sticks. And it's so easy to do. You can do it anywhere. You can literally use anything. And we thought it'd be a good opportunity since we're together today to kind of run you guys through it so we can kind of give you guys some more tools for your toolbox. And literally while we were talking about it, I have some gravel stones that are lined up in my driveway and we literally just picked nine, nine pieces of stone up as you can see here, that's, that's in focus. As you can see here that we're gonna use today and they have, we have them lined up here on the inside of the garage. As you can see down this line here, and um, I'm gonna run you guys through, through pickup sticks. So I usually use this for like a leg day finisher, but you can also use this as an entire workout. And we'll get into that in more detail later because I think we can piggyback off a lot of this stuff from today and some other videos. But I'm gonna demonstrate to you guys um, by the numbers, just for demonstration purposes only, a little walkthrough on kind of how this operation goes. And then I'm gonna run, full through, run through it full speed for you guys to kind of show you guys how it's done and then get some um, interaction from there. So basically we're gonna take nine pieces of either toilet paper, paper towel, um, notebook paper, anything you can find. You're gonna ball them up into a little ball, or as like I said, we have these stones here. You're gonna start at the first one. You're gonna bend down in the squat. It's gotta be a perfect squat, literally parallel or below. You're gonna grab the rock or whatever your, your, piece, of, your piece of paper, whatever you have. You're gonna grab that, you're gonna step forward. On the second one, you're gonna squat down and you're gonna take the first stone you had, place it on the ground, squat up. Next one, you're gonna squat down, and now you're gonna pick one up. Squat down, pick two up, or pick one up, now you have two. Step forward, we're on our third stone right now. I'm gonna squat down, drop one stone, come back up. Squat down with the third stone, come back up. Now I'm gonna squat down individually and pick up each one of the rocks. So one, two, three, boom. I'm gonna step forward and now I'm gonna squat and put one down. If you guys can see how repetition this is, you're just gonna squat, put them down, squat, pick them up. It's so simplistic. And you're literally gonna follow this entire um, round, or you're, you're gonna follow this entire motion straight through to the end. One thing you'll notice while I do this, guys, is I like to keep my hand higher than my head. And one of the reasons that I do that and so I have one targeted place to place everything each time I come up, but also to keep my posture and my squat form really good because, or proper, because if I put your hand up and you squat down, you're gonna keep really good posture as you do that. If you tend to just drop your shoulders and drop everything in front of you, you're gonna, you're gonna end up squatting down like this. So I try to keep myself up so I keep that perfect, that perfect squat form. So now that I demonstrated that to you guys, by the numbers, just to kind of show you guys how it goes. Now I'm gonna run you through you guys, run this through with you guys. You guys can tell that I'm smoking today. Run this through for you guys at full speed. So here we go. All right, ready? And if you miss it, guys, you gotta go back down and pick it up in perfect form. And as you go, you'll notice little things like dexterity start getting messed up and you cannot grab these things. And this is the first time we've done this with these stones too. So this is a little awkward, but like I said, you can use anything to do this. So if you're traveling in a hotel, traveling Airbnb, at home, can't make it to the gym like we all can't right now. This is just a really good leg day exercise or finisher to incorporate into your workouts. Woo! Shit, I grabbed two bicep. All right.
I'm gonna throw them, come on. Sometimes even I need to give myself a little pep toss to keep this shit going. Fuck it. Woo. Uh, and I'm, all right, last one, here we go. All right, let's eight down, nine up. Shit. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Oh, shit. Got to pay the toll. Uh, uh. All right. So that is pickup sticks. And literally, guys, these are just stones from the, from the driveway. But my challenge to you guys right now is to get motivated, stay positive, take it outside. Whatever you have to do to keep going, guys, right now, make it happen. So is there anything that I can do on my end, like little videos like this to help you guys? Let me know, because at the end of the day, we're all going through this together. We're all on the same team, and it's what we do. So I challenge everybody to take it outside, do a round of pickup sticks, or do two, three, four, five rounds. Comment below, let me know how it goes. Any questions, DM me. You guys have a great weekend. I'm gonna go shower and eat. I fucking smoked. See ya.